All right. Spirit Halloween is officially open. Let's uh, go inside and see what they got. Spooky, spooky, spooky. <laughs> got some t-shirts in here, such as Stab, You're It. A lot of Terrifier stuff. Beetlejuice, Terrifier, of course. I can't hold my liquor. That's awesome. Ooh, slither in, why don't you? Because I'm bald. Yes. I see how it is. Oh, we got some Disney pins. So that's cool. If you want to get some pins to your collection for Nightmare for Christmas, they, they have them here for $9. Obviously, they're still getting stuff set up. Not too much here yet. Still setting up all the displays and props. Oh, I love all the ghost stations. That's cool. Don't kill my vibes. God, I remember when that came out when I was younger, and it's still, still going strong. I would wear this, like, every day. Look at it. That's it's not cool. too heavy. I would never. That's a $190 disappointment right there. Now, if you could have this at your house, out in your driveway for Halloween, you would be the talk of the neighborhood. This is awesome. You going to tell me my fortune, please? Tell it. Oh, it does not look good. Spend it like you mean it. No, I don't want to break it. Alright, alright, don't break it. Eyeball. That's lame, it should make it where you can actually spin it. The quality is not not quite there to actually spin it. <laughs> you break, you buy. <laughs> Disappointing. Right, it looks like they're gonna have a Disney Haunted Mansion section. Obviously more on the way. Modeled after the California one, I believe. Got some tombstones. It'd be cool if they could find a way to do a Madame Leota tombstone where it's like a nine volt, you know, battery where the eyes can open up and move. And it could be something you can buy for Halloween. That'd be awesome and they should totally do it. And not that Harry Potter has anything to do with Halloween, but they're gonna have a little section right here. And they got some signs. Looks like these light up. At least the Bates Motel one. What do we got here? Oh, they still Halloween? Yeah. Ooh. That's cute. We're in the, the goth section for home decor. Got some pentagram slithery snakes. Uh, little bowl for trinkets and such. <laughs> the tablecloths. The full on goth section. Dead and breakfast. Service to die for. Relax and rest in peace. Stay forever. <laughs> This one right here is pretty cool. In case of possession, break glass. Got the full size good guys doll. That's cool. Want some trick or treat. What I really want is that worm, but I can't find a price tag. Some yard decor for Beetlejuice. Got a little Hocus Pocus section. You can help make hospitals it's just a bunch of Hocus Pocus. Directional signs. See the magic live in concert. For inflatable yard decor, what do we got here? I like this one. We got the spooky ghost. The pumpkin arch. Not too scary. I haven't seen a hearse yet. Maybe I just didn't go to Spirit last year, but that's pretty cool. I like that. We got Cujo, man's possessed friend, Bubba. All right. 
I like these. That's cool. The Grave Watcher. <sighs> Speak spine chilling phrases while arms move back and forth. <laughs> Sounds super scary. Got a tombstone. Do you recognize it? Do I recognize Is it? Like oh, look at that. It's been 300 years, right down to the day. Or whatever Dolly Parton said. Terrifying, terrifyingly not, not screen accurate. <laughs> so one thing I wish they could do with these masks is just make them more accurate to the film version, but I get it. Mass production. You gotta just do what you can do, right? All right, so here we have uh, the infamous old lady mask as made famous on the internet with the, the long finger. And here's everyone's favorite disc jockey. Stay puff. We got the middle school goth kids starter packs here. Get your spooky tattoos. Darkness, darkness. Well, good day to you, sir. Oh, good evening to you. Well, that's a bona fide beauty. Any questions? Yes. Several. Oh, yeah, dude, like, save the princess and, like, slay the dragon, <laughs> if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> the section for blessed things? Nothing. Sounds like the intro to a uh, King Diamond record. Uh, watch out for Miriam and Jonathan. Don't trip down the stairs. Oh, you caught me. Of course you found this section. <laughs> I can't wait to see what else they put out. But this is just straight up PJs. What is this? This I would is wear it. I would wear it. Stitch costume. It's a set of PJs. Come on, son. Come on. What the hell is this? Welcome, foolish mortals. Awesome. Then they have the Beetlejuice one. It's cool. It's hard to film in here with all this horrible copyright music playing, but they got uh, some more Haunted Mansion Disney stuff. Fleece throw blanket. That's pretty cool. Oh, what do we have here? You can be my nameless ghoul from the band Ghost. Ah, have a night of Halloween, trick or treating, and sin. Are you with us? Ah. Just noticed they have uh, the Fun House of Terror. Let's do it. Too slow. Ooh, it doesn't really look like that. Nah, you scared again? Ooh. Terrifying. Just got back from Spirit Halloween. That was fun. I haven't been to a Spirit Halloween in almost a year. Last Halloween, right? <laughs> but yeah, I think that location has only been open for about two or three days. There's still a bunch of stuff that's out of stock. Not out of stock, but not on the shelf yet. Um, there's a couple more animatronics that they still have to set up, such as there's one for Art the Clown, um, the characters from Corpse Bride, uh, Ghostface from Scream, and a few other ones that they still need to put out. Um, but it was cool. Lots of stuff in there that we definitely want to buy, such as the Madame Leota tombstone that apparently they do make. And I didn't know that, but. From looking online, apparently they do have that, but it just wasn't out yet on the shelf. But all in all, fun afternoon going to Spirit Halloween, one of our favorite stores for the holidays. Um, definitely getting us in the Halloween spirit. <laughs> but yeah, in spirit. But it was fun. Nice, chill evening around the house, going out the spirit. Nice day. 
If you watched the whole thing, thank you as always, and uh, we'll see you in the next video. Later.